I understand we do have Walt Gray and our Becca Humbegger standing by. Uh, they have been there all evening. They are kind of looking down with a bird's eye view at all the fans. Mm -hmm. Talk to us about this experience. I mean, it was one thing for us to go back to the playoffs. It's mm -hmm. another to go back and win on game one. Oh, Chris and Laura, I just have to say the energy here is more than electric. I would say it is laser powered. As you can see, the beat behind us, even in the last seconds of the game, fans were streaming out of Golden One Center, chanting, light the beam, light the beam. They were so ready to see that. And we got to sit here, stand here, and watch as the beam live the night sky. I mean, it is a sea of people back there. Walt, have you seen anything like this before? Well, the last time they were in the playoffs was 2006, but that was at the end of an era of success. So since that time, obviously, it's been 16 seasons, 17, you know, depending on how you count it. But this is all pent up. And if we can get Tyler to come in and maybe get a shot of this, this is absolutely crazy. And there's still people who are exiting the arena. There are thousands and thousands of people, and they're just milling around. Everybody in a Kings fan is slapping high five with a fellow Kings fan, even the Warrior fans. It's all good right now. Kings fans are like, hey, we'll see you Monday night. Warrior fans say, we'll be back. And that's where it all renew again. But you know what? This is what this arena was built for. The downtown, the whole vibe, and in a night like this, where you can have the area businesses absolutely packed. People coming in before the game. People staying after the game. And I was just hoping that game one would end up in a victory for the Kings because it's just carried over that vibe, Becca, that we saw before the game. I thought, wow, if they lose, what a downer. But this crowd is just, it's like people have been talking about, just exploding and how proud they are. And I thought this was a must-win game for the Kings. Monday night, I think, still is, because the next two are going to be in San Francisco. Yeah, you know, while I talked with some fans and asked their prediction, a lot of them said Kings in six, but hey, the ones who said Kings in four, they made that a possibility tonight. Uh, Chris and Laura, we're going to toss it back to you as we cover this excitement out here at Golden One Center. Just wonderful to see all those crowds down there at Golden One celebrating this historic night. Stand by. We'll come back to you shortly.